Shishu means child and Purajanma means rebirth. And after all, rehabilitation is a form of rebirth. Uh, but this was focused at children. And um, uh, we, we found a lot of children with talent uh, who were disabled. In fact, I sometimes wonder whether the disability itself complemented the talent because I found a lot of visually impaired children very good in music and several hearing and speech impaired children who are excellent artists. So the thought came into our minds that why not we help out such children with a scholarship so that they can pursue their talent. And right now we have 12 uh, children who are receiving the scholarship. What is unique about the scholarship is it's uh, it's a two-way scholarship. We give an, uh, uh, an amount to the child so that it helps with the transportation and we give a matching grant to the trainer. So the person who's training uh, actually is, is he need not do it for free. He is actually paid what others normally pay him for training. They also are given a lot of uh, opportunities to perform. For example, in our Rehab Basics conference, we organize these uh, children's children to give concerts and uh, it's, it's a very heartening sight because their their quality of performance is almost professional so the audience is also uh, you know clapping and cheering and they all enjoy the the programs that these children give <laughs> I must also tell you that our uh, artists have sold several of their paintings at market rates. So again, this this is not something that we are we are helping out or something. But yes, of course, they they are being helped out because they have a handicap. But the quality of their work is not short of any that a normal person would 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 do. Mehta Balam was a boy with. Uh, um, in intellectual subnormality and he he was autistic also but he paints beautifully so his work of art was recognized by president of india and he got the national award uh, this year too there is a boy called satya narayana who was a who is an excellent singer so this boy was started when he was in the 8th or 9th standard last year he he decided he would take up music as a profession he is visually impaired and then he joined the music academy and uh, it's very heartening to know that he topped his batch in Carnatic music. He was, he was the first rank holder in practicals and theory. <laughs> Jagadish, who plays the tabla, he has performed in, in, in choirs and orchestra. Hidya Tola is visually impaired, but he plays the keyboard like a pro. So does Prabhakaran, who plays the drums. He is also visually impaired. So, when you look at the musical quality of these children, they keep, uh, they perform in all, all professional roles uh, in the orchestra. So, I would like that also to extend to the level that these children can be followed through and uh, they can uh, probably take up this this uh, field as their career one of the aspects of um, freedom trust has been education to rehab professionals being inter interdisciplinary i think 
Rehab Basics was the ideal forum where uh, these doctors, the paramedicals, uh, the rehab professionals, sometimes even the social workers and others can get together and exchange their ideas. And we've been running it for the last five years very successfully, once a year. And uh, the audience is a sellout. We get up to uh, 350 to 400 students participating. We invite lecturers from all over and they uh, high class lectures on neurology or various conditions in rehabilitation or about the appliances used. All these things come out in Rehab Basics. novel concept called the appliance bank where uh, used appliances uh, were like old wheelchairs all these things can be um, donated to the trust and the trust can actually uh, give it to those who, who cannot afford it for a for a very subsidized price or even free it isn't too difficult sometimes to uh, modify or uh, repair the appliances even if they are calipers uh, and fit them on to another needy person. Uh, we have a team of orthotists also to do the job. Freedom Trust wishes to um, get these appliances from the public, from the community at large, and also for, from abroad, you know, because appliances which um, are not needed there can always be shipped across to Freedom Trust and we use them here.